Hi everyone, in this video I am going to share my PayPal interview experience. These are the details about the role. The stipend was 50k, the role was SD intern role and the type of offer was a 6 months internship offer. So this was a diversity hiring program especially for female candidates and the name of program was Unity Bloom with PayPal. So we registered on this website Hacker Earth but it was not a hackathon. It was a mentorship program. Around these many people registered. So we were given resources and mentorship from PayPal mentors. Around six modules were there. And what I mean by module is like module one was operating system. Module two was Python. Module three was SQL. Module four was data structure. And we were provided resources to learn everything from scratch. Like it was kind of mentorship session where they were teaching us everything from scratch and then they are hiring us. This type of program is Unity Bloom with PayPal. They are providing resources and we can ask our doubts to the mentors of PayPal. So this was the program Unity Bloom with PayPal for the female candidates. And after completion of every module, we were given hacker rank test to test our knowledge of that subject that uh, module was given so they also conducted motivational sessions every month it all started in april and the interviews were conducted in november followed by the results from our college around five to six girls were selected for the interview and five or four of them accepted the offer after the three rounds of interview this is the interview details and around three rounds of interview were conducted each round was one hour round, two were technical round and one was managerial round. So in round one, I gave my introduction and then followed by the interviewer's introduction. Then two coding questions were asked directly. One was related to changing the position of elements in different orders. Like there is an array given and we have to change the position of particular elements, which was asked by the interviewer. Like change the position of first and third element. This type of question was asked and then he twisted the question like the array is not given. Now the string is given in the form of numbers and we have to change the position of the numbers. And I was asked to write the whole code, pseudo code on Google Docs and dry run it and explain the time complexity and the whole running of the code. So the second question was given a number n and find the minimum number of squares that sum to x. So these two questions were asked in round one and I was able to explain both of them. So I cleared round one and I went to round two, which was also a technical round. In this round, I was asked one coding question, which was related to finding all the duplicates in a number in all possible ways I can think, along with the full working code and the time complexity of each approach that I told. So the interviewer basically wanted to check whether I, I am able to write the full code or not. He asked me to open a code editor. I opened the VS code and then in that I wrote the whole program and I run the code and then the output came. So further I explained the time complexity and many approaches of solving this question because there are many ways we can solve this question. So around four to five ways I told him and he was satisfied. Then further discussions were related to my resume, my final year projects. So after that, the interview ended and I got a mail for round three, which was a managerial round, which was with the manager, a senior manager of PayPal. So the lady was very kind and very friendly. So I was enjoying this round three. So after I gave my introduction, she asked me to tell the challenges that I faced in lockdown. So I explained her all the challenges that I faced. Then she wanted me to know. <clears throat> she wanted me to tell the latest technologies that I know. Like she asked me about React. She asked me the difference between machine learning and artificial intelligence. These type of questions were asked by her. Then she asked me a DBMS query. It was related to finding a third or fourth highest salary of the employees given in a table. So I wrote the query. 
then he she asked me to write a snippet of inheritance which is a concept of object oriented program so i wrote the code of inheritance a small snippet of inheritance then we had a discussion about my final year project then she asked some questions related to my personality like what are your strengths weaknesses she gave me some random situations and then she asked me to tell how will i react to that situations so this was all about round 3 and then after 2 3 days i got a call from the hr that i have cleared all the interviews and i got the 6 months internship offer so this was all about my interview experience with paypal thank you